Hey there, friends. This is Deanna Thornton here, standing right outside 2277 El Cejo Circle in Rancho Cordova, right? So let's go ahead and take a look inside this amazing home. It's a four bedroom, gosh, one, two, two and a half baths, uh, plus some other special things. It's about 2,400 square feet, plus there's a shop. So there's a garage and a shop and a storage shed. So we're gonna check all of this out and let me see. Oh, and in the meantime, say you want to go ahead and take a look around. Like, you want to maybe look at the circle this is in. Like, if you circle around, you'll see right over there, we have access. You can just walk right over to the River Bend Park. Like, hello, it's right there. And uh, so, or if you ride bikes, that's a great place to go riding your bike or taking your family on a picnic. So let's go ahead and take a look inside. We have a big old fashioned door here that is very sturdy and strong, very solid. All right, welcome. So this is our first glimpse when you walk in. You can either go this way, upstairs, or this way. We're gonna go this way. Doo -doo. So here is our formal living room with our plantation shutters. And ta-da. Our dining room. And we have some dual pane windows, more plantation shutters. And what's great about this area is that you can see all the way out your front and all the way out your back. And then come on into the kitchen area. So into the kitchen we are. We have a brand new faucet and sink and dishwasher and refrigerator and microwave. Let's see. Did I mention this? the stove top is also gas stove top never ever been used before. So you could be the first one to use that. Um, did I mention the granite countertops? Those have also recently been installed. Then also over here there is a double oven that is gas as well. And then it's time to go to my favorite room in the entire house. Ta -da! This is like your sunroom area, office, living room, place where your family's really going to hang out and be, be together and really enjoy life. So yeah, this one, what I love about this is it's got beaded ceilings all the way through. You can see the beams in this room and in that one. And so it's kind of like two rooms put together with a lot of windows. And in the windows, you get to go take a peek in the backyard. So we're gonna just take a peek in the backyard real quick. So we have a big old swimming pool. This swimming pool is a saltwater swimming pool. And something else special to note about this is from that line all the way over to there, all of this is cool deck. So on a hot day, you're not burning your toes. So that is really, really fabulous. So. Uh, and the other thing that's fascinating and amazing is it being a saltwater pool. Well, chlorine right now, I don't know if you knew this, is actually quite expensive. So you're covered with your salt water. So over here is a massive area, a, like shed. So in case you need more storage, there's storage in here. And then you can get right in here and there's storage here and there's a little ramp. So if you have like a motorbike or a motorcycle, like you can just Put it on up through the ramp. So the ramp goes in and out. All right, let's go this way. There is lots and lots to see. So over here, we have a little gazebo area. Oh my goodness, I forgot to mention, there is a hot tub. The hot tub is negotiable. And um, there's also some other really cool things about this hot tub that I'm gonna point out to you. So this goes down, lays flat on top of this. Uh, when you take out this pin right here, I'm like, should I try it one-handed? We're going to try it one-handed. So then what happens is this lifts up off the hot tub. Okay, you need two hands for it. So anyway, this lifts up and then your lid goes blink. And so you don't have the, the struggle that homeowners sometimes have with their lid. Hmm, over here is our... <laughs> There's a drone. Um, over here, my friends, 
is our shop. Let's see if it's open. Excellent. It is open. So inside here is a 700 square foot extra shop. And uh, what's great about it is it's got, I want to say it's seven by four, four by seven, like construction, where basically it's cool in here right now. It's, there's an air conditioner, but the current owner has never even had to use the air conditioning. And so it's just been a really fabulous shop workspace for him. And say you wanted to get a vehicle in through this gate right over here. That is totally a possibility. So that's about an eight foot opening. You can bring your vehicle right in and go work on it in the garage if you should need to. All right, there's some other little details I wanna uh, look at out here. Just because they're small and they're, I mean, when else are you gonna hear about it? Okay, you see this little chain? So the reason that chain is there is so that when the water drops, it goes doop, doop, doop down that down that chain because otherwise he would have to have a drain like this one over here that would go all the way back and then it would be like what go across or get your right there wet so this totally is a solution for that very exciting and also back to the hot tub I forgot to mention this if you needed some uh, shade then or some privacy this guy comes right down and Gives you the privacy that you might need. All right, and then also we have the option to watch TV out here. All right, let's go inside and see the rest of the house because there's even more to see. So, remember that hallway when you first entered? Well, say you don't want to have anything to do with the hallway, or you do, and here we are. Um, under the stairs, we've got some under the stairs storage. Boink. So, and that goes all the way to here, and there's even a little shelf there. So here, you can see it for yourself. Okay, and then right over here, we have the half bath. Now, we're gonna mosey on upstairs where there's more to see. Doo -doo. So up here, we also have, this is actually a full house fan, but it has a cover on it for when it rains. So that cover come out and hook right here. So that's pretty fabulous. Off to the right, we have our first room with some major mirrors. And you can just kind of see all around. All right, and now that you've had your chance, let's go to the next room. This one is sort of like an office. Or it could be if you want it to. However, it is technically a bedroom because it has a closet. So. And then, here's the shared bath for the bathrooms upstairs. So, again, nice little updates. We have the granite countertop. And some updates in here with a beautiful shower and look at jetted bathtub. All right. And we're going to mosey on in here. This is one of our other bedrooms. So just a regular size bedroom. Being good if you need to be near mom and dad or whomever. All right. And then this, my friends, is the primary. So, we have quite a bit of room in here. And then we have the primary room staff right in here. So we have, again, the granite countertop, a full length mirror. And then in here we have a, a shower, a walk-in shower, and a, and a toilet. And that is my story morning glory. So anyway, if you would like to come and see this house in person, you know who to call. Let's see. I'm going to go down and end in my favorite this room of all. Do you remember where that is? It's the sunroom. Ta-da! I actually think I like the pool the best. Maybe.
we're going to end in the pool. Because you know what? I bet you've never done that before. Have you ended a video in the pool? That's what we're going to do. All right. Thanks for joining me today, and I will see you soon in person. Bye.